Welcome back, guys. This is Tough Choice. I am your host, Kazim Rahman. Our guest today, normally, normally, when we have a guest and it's his first time on the podcast, we have a sound effect for that. I've never been out of the village before. But once upon a time, there was a little podcast named Tough Choice. And the host didn't know how to edit a podcast. So we didn't know how to edit our guest, Tim Mathis, who just, you know, the levels weren't the same. Mm -hmm. I apologized Mm -hmm. to Tim just now. It happened two years ago, Mm -hmm. and I just now apologized. So technically, he is a returning champion. 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 Ladies and gentlemen, on the hot seat today in the studio of ignorance, welcome Tim Mathis. How you doing, Tim? Hello. Back again for the first time. You're back again for the first time. Time. My bad, bro. It's a, <laughs> it's it's forgiven, but I, I it is LA and I didn't have to drive twice. So. My bad. But then now you got water, you got hot sauce. I, I do huh? like that you you upgraded everything. I upgraded everything. Upgraded we, everything. We started in the bedroom across the hall, and then the old lady died, and I took her apartment, and now we're here. There you go. You got it's a great. poolside apartment, bro. I got a poolside apartment. In LA, ladies. In LA. In LA. <laughs> Weirdly enough, that is a low key flex. That's it, a I mean, weird, it's, it's, that I'm, is not a weird low I'm not hating. I'm not hating. In LA, I gotta walk three blocks side. to get to a pool. You you can yeah. walk out your patio, bro. Fair enough, Tim. Are you ready for this? I think so, guys. You know how we do it here. The game is tough choice. We don't really waste any time. You must pick between the two choices. You get one pass. You get one pause. You must explain yourself. And at the end, of course, we have our final choice. <laughs> Let it begin. Let it begin. Tim Mathis, now it is time for our constant choice. I did not tell you this in the beginning. What so we've changed things up a little bit okay. since you've been here last time in our last episode. So every month there is one question that every guest will get. Okay. So your constant choice for this month is, let's say you are trapped in a horror movie. Okay. Right. You have three choices. Yeah. Number one, you can be the first victim who gets taken out quickly and never sees it coming. Or you can be the best friend who's killed right before the climax. Or you can be the last person standing whose friends have all died, horrible deaths, and who now gets terrorized in the sequel. Ah, see, that sequel part really gets you. Yes. The sequel part really gets you. Um, Yeah. Darn. You know movies more than I know movies. I do. I do. I've been watching nothing but B-horror movies lately. Speaking of horror in general, uh, play Friday the 13th, the video game. It's great. Really? Yeah. It's the best survival horror game ever. I'll uh, check it out. It's amazing. Okay. Um, Anyway, as far as who I I would probably, out of that choice, I'd just like to get capped early and call it a night. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Because, I mean, the best friend dies. Okay, yes. so you got to think. Well, you're in the movie. I My thought was, and correct me if I'm wrong, because mm-hmm. I don't know movies like that, like that. Yeah. I'm thinking if I'm the best friend who gets killed right before the climax, uh-huh. you know who I am. But then it's like right before the climax, but I don't know when a climax of a movie is. I mean, look, is. if is I'm an actor, if, if you're yeah. asking me as an actor, then I want to be the, the final person so I can get oh, that sequel money. Yes. I mean, yeah. Mm. Oh, if we're acting, if we're asking career wise, then yes. yeah, definitely the person coming back for sequels. Okay, cool. The, yeah. If it's career wise, your sequel. But, but what if, it's, if it's a real If thing? it's just a real scenario, like if it happened tonight, then just. Oh, no, but I it's a horror movie. Well. Yeah, if it's so a horror movie. You're trapped in. Never mind. You're I, right. That's fine. You want to get capped early. Yeah. If I if 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 it's a normal thing, right? Yes. If I'm just one of the characters and I'm not an actor, yes. then capped early because okay. I don't want to deal with this crap like uh a year down the road and he's mm. killed more of my friends. And it, they always up the victims. So he's not gonna kill friends next time. He's probably gonna kill your sister or your cousin oh, or some crap like that. No. Yeah. It always gets worse in the sequels. Wow. Yeah. It escalates. I never even. Oh, wow. Yeah. So you don't want that. So I'm if, trying to think. Yeah. Plus the person that gets killed first, a lot of times is getting laid. So he's getting laid when yeah. he gets killed or, or smoking weed. So either way, you're having a nice time. You're, you get, you die with a smile. On your there face. you go. Wow. Okay. I don't know why for some reason I'm thinking I'd rather be the best friend. So the people know who I am at least. 
But then you, right? yeah, if you're an actor, that's fine. Yeah. But if it's real no, life even stuff, if it's real life, I'll if it's real life the stuff, then friend. you just fight a lot. You probably get hurt a lot because you're going toe to toe with this thing, and then you probably have a bad death. Yeah, you're right because I, the deaths have to get get worse mm. as the show, as the especially if it's a slasher movie. You start yeah. off with usually your worst kill in a slasher movie is like the end of the second act, start of the third act. Damn, because that's when you know the yeah. The slasher is really angry. Yeah, yeah, you're right. See, if it's right before the climax, so, and and that, that would be you. Put, that yeah, you I'm would probably get fight. you, and you'd probably get split in half or your neck ripped out with his really? hand. Or, yeah, it would be bad. Yeah, be, you don't want to be. Would have to be a bad that, one. That would be the worst one. Yeah. Wow. I mean, if you look at most movies, damn, you don't want to be the best friend, bro. Okay. Dang, man. Because you, that's that's one of the characters. For me. But that's one of the characters they set up. They give that character a lot of backstory. So he when so he dies when they a die, it's death. A, yeah. And, and you might go out a hero, you know, you might be the one that like, you know, does but something. But I'm still yeah, You're but still I'm still gonna putting get up a fight really bad. You're going to get like your jaw ripped off right? or some shit. Yeah. Damn. Damn. Like that OJ dude who like said they put a he put up a fight and OJ was stabbing him allegedly all allegedly oh yeah uh, yeah all alleged especially because he's out so yeah. all alleged all alleged OJ <laughs> OJ come do tough choice <laughs> I'm just saying you're in Vegas only like four hours away come on now would you rather only be able to eat from vending machines or bungee jump off a cliff? With the cord attached to your ears. Okay. Ving uh, 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 vending machines, no question. You didn't even have to yeah. finish that sentence. I'm, I'm deathly afraid of heights, so I would never bungee jump under any circumstances. Under any circumstances. Well, the only way I'd bungee jump is if somebody gave me that horror movie sequel role, mm. and then I would jump the shit out of that cliff. Yeah. If you were like the first victim... No, 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 not the first victim. Oh, if you, I was an actor, I would want to come back for the want You want to be the last person yeah. standing. Yeah. Yeah, I'll do the vending machines. Yeah, me too. Because one, I think when I wrote this question, I didn't understand how having something attached to your ears when you're jumping off Yeah, a cliff, it's going to hurt regardless. Your ears are gone. Yeah. Forget your ears. You're going to die. Your, your head, <laughs> your head is... Die. I'm thinking... I don't oh, know so why... so you wrote this question? I wrote this question. Oh, okay. I'm thinking... Don't judge me. <laughs> I'm thinking, for some reason, I think I was thinking your ear wasn't really attached to, like, your head and your neck. Yeah, no, you would Right? Die. You're dead. You're dead. Yeah. That's... But you, let, you lost me at bungee jump. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You said bungee. I was already... Okay, fair. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Also, vending machines are, can get healthy now. I mean, they can, but... They can. There's trail it's mix. Mostly, it's mostly just chips. There's at least trail mix. There's jerky. Yeah. Right? There's an old apple somewhere. You know? Maybe. You never know. You never know. Would you rather only be able to communicate via FaceTime? Or have everyone in the world speak too quietly for you to hear them? Well, I mean, if you couldn't hear anybody, then I guess, could you communicate other ways? You, if you know I'm, what? I'm thinking I, if it's too quietly, you'll oh, have to get close to them. No, that's fine. Because I, I would do the second one. Hmm. I don't want to hear anybody talk. That would be great. Tim, you have to hear people talk. No, you don't. You, everything can be done in text now. We don't have to talk to each other. Oh. That. You know, other than for entertainment purposes yeah. and, and public safety, I think. Yeah. And other than that, just don't even talk. I have my earphones in anytime I go out anywhere. Um, so, yeah. I, I, I never thought about that. Yeah. That would be great. That would be heaven. What about me. FaceTime? Well, no, you could still use FaceTime. I mean. But they speak too quietly. Well, I don't even use FaceTime. So right. it wouldn't bother me at all. Like, personally, if you're asking me. I, I mean, I just. Uh, Deactivated my Facebook account. Like I'm trying really? to, yeah. I'm. Uh, it, there's so many distractions. Yeah. Like you gotta shut shut them down. Yeah, uh, I agree. I see what you're saying. And yeah, if if I if I could just communicate in text message, that would cut everything out. That'd be great. I don't know. You're right, but I need people to. Well, here's the problem. Here's why you kind of have to do the speak too quietly because it's if it's communicate via FaceTime. Let's say I'm here and you're like right there. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, I that would get, be ridiculous. I have to get on FaceTime to communicate with you. Yeah, that'd be ridiculous. I can't just speak to you. Exactly. So I, yeah, you're right. Yeah. I don't like that question. And I wrote it. <laughs> would you rather get tackled by an NFL linebacker running at full speed or have a kidney stone the size of a pea? Well, I've never had a kidney stone, knock on wood, because I probably should have already. Okay. Okay. Considering how bad my diet is. Yes. Um, no, you've been losing weight. I am losing out. weight, but I mean, it, uh, kidney stones is from stuff like junk food, and I still oh, okay. do. I, I still do eat some junk. The food. occasional Taco Bell, in my opinion, is fine. It's not real meat. Well, anyway, no, but I so mean, we're good. Yeah, in general, I mean, yeah. I'm losing weight by eating lean cuisines, and that's not even food. Those are basically fair. just chemicals. That's fair. Um, Shout out to lean cuisine. <laughs> yeah, you can always, you know. Hey, you will lose weight, but podcast. I mean, I'm probably just eating cancer at this point. Oh, of course. Um, but anyway, yeah. yeah, you're probably losing weight because you got cancer. I mean, it's possible. It's possible. It's possible. Guys, we're joking. Oh, we're God. not serious. We get emails sometimes from some I'm things sorry. we've said. <laughs> anyway what was the question tackled by an nfl linebacker running at full speed full I, speed at full i would do that because no. from what i i, I would do yeah no it, it, tim have you seen okay i've seen jadavion Clowney on tv and that's fine he looks like a specimen have you seen him in person because no. i've seen him in person okay i'm sure he's I a am, large but he but I he am, was a defensive end Oh, yeah. I mean, he was a defensive end slash this, linebacker. Exactly. Do so I get to pick this? the linebacker? No, you do not get to pick the linebacker. Is it picked at random or are mm. they going to give me fucking the best, biggest linebacker in the damn league and kill me? Maybe not the best, biggest, but they're going to give you the guy that's willing to go I'll take, tackle. Is it the average NFL linebacker? They're going to give you the guy that's willing to go, that's crazy enough to willing to go tackle a civilian. At so Vontez Perfect. That's who's tackling Boom. me. Vontez Perfect. Yes. Okay. No, I would not want to get tackled. Vontez. <laughs> if, if, if it's, it's Vontez. If it's Vontez Perfect, then I'll take the kidney stuff. Yeah, exactly. Listen, okay. Full speed. It's I'm not fine. like I'll take the thing. You, no, you convinced me. Not, I wanted to go with the I'm kidney stone, but you you talked me out of it. I am explaining to the change, audience. People. Change the name to from tough choice to my choice Kazeem, with yeah, Kazim Ramon. Listen, you'd, be <laughs> you'd be surprised how many times I've had to slowly convince someone to just go my way. Here's why I'm doing kidney stone. Yes, kidney stone size of a pea. That's probably surgery. You need surgery. Oh, if it's surgery, that. then I'll definitely take the linebacker. Really? Yeah, because my only uh, my only thing about the linebacker thing is like eh, you might be in the hospital longer from the linebacker. No, but if, if I'm getting surgery on my dick, you can't. Then I'm taking the linebacker. You can't pass a right? kidney stone, right? Don't they? Don't they have to like cut your dick out? Um, not no. Out, they go. But they go in. They yeah. go in through your penis. Okay. You're unconscious. Tim. All right. This, You're listen. unconscious. Tim. They're doing surgery near my penis, Tim. I'm taking the linebacker. I get what you're saying. You're un first of all, that is my final answer. They go in through your penis. I don't care if they go in through the moon. Yeah. Well, it depends on where the kidney stone is. They might go in through your kidneys and that's through your. Back. I don't want them to go in at all. Okay. So it, I would take a broken couple bones. Okay. What's the worst that'll happen if this linebacker hits me? Actually, you I know might what? get a punctured lung. You know I might what? get a punctured lung. No, you're not going to get or a concussion. Lung. Shit. You're going to get a concussion. Okay. I've probably had a concussion before. Yeah. No and big we deal. All, we grew yeah. up in the South. Yeah. Everyone grew up Everybody, in the South. Listen, if you if you were one of the kids that still played outside in the 80s and 90s, yeah. you probably had concussions. If we you played football listen, and shit. if you weren't no bitch when you were young, yeah. then you probably had a concussion yeah. before. And you went to sleep and didn't die. What's you up, mom? Die. What's I up, dad? I sleep all the time with like multiple <laughs> concussions. No, nah, I don't think so. Maybe. Probably not. Anyway, my point is I'm I'll, taking the line back Okay. Here. If I got to get surgery on it, I never thought about that. Then I'm taking the line back. I'm not even going to lie. I, at first, I was going to say kidney stone. Yeah. So I convinced I realized, you. But then I realized mm. it's the size of a pea. Yeah. That's, that's, that's a big stone. That's big. And I've heard that they're like one of the most painful things it's that you can possibly painful. abdore. It's ridiculous. Yeah. So, so they compare it to childbirth. Yeah. 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 So, yeah, I'm so, definitely taking uh, the line back. Because yeah. uh, worst case scenario, I'm in the hospital for a week. Yeah. And here's the thing about the NFL linebacker. To the best of my knowledge, it's not. It doesn't say you're getting blindsided. Yeah. Let's say just tackled. Yeah, Vontez is running from fifty. As soon as he touches me, at, I'm, I'm pulling a quarterback. Yeah. I'm pulling, as soon as he touches me, I'm 
I'm down. Sliding. Wor- worst case scenario, he <laughs> might hit me in the knee, and w- but I get to wear pads, right? So I mean, you, this is how much you just don't respect quarterbacks. As soon as he touches me, as pulling the quarterback. As soon as he touches me. <laughs> as soon as he breaks, what do they call yeah. it? The halo around the. You yeah. Know, just going as down. soon as he's in my no, range. They're wearing pads. Yeah. But if, if I'm on the ground, right, and one yeah. of my parts of my body touches the ground while he touches me, then I'm tackled. Yeah. So if he's coming and he goes to spear me, I'm yeah. ducking and I'm just putting my elbow on the ground and just You're not going to try to at least barely, br- You're not going to try to at least It didn't say I had to get it first down. Mm, All it said I I tackle. just got to get tackled. I'm running the other way to be yeah. honest with you. He could tackle me from behind cuz he going to catch me. So I'm running the other way. And if you're running and he just pushes you that's still a That's tackle. a tackle. And guess what? As soon as he touches me, I'm going down. You know what? That there's, is correct. Yeah, there's a loophole. That is correct. Yeah. That is, I will allow yeah. that loophole Thank you. simply because if we're talking about football. Yeah, we're going tackle, by the rules of football we did for not, tackles. We did not say. And hey, if we're going by college rules, I'm just taking a knee. Fuck y'all. Shut <laughs> up. Tim, you may not. No, you may not. You're getting touched. It is NFL. You're getting you touched by an NFL, NFL linebacker. And since technically a, a tackle is him touching mm-hmm. you and you hitting the Falling ground. Down, yeah. And I'm running this flat other way. Oh, so course. if he slaps my ankle, guess what? I'm done. Yeah. <laughs> Damn. All right. Yeah, we didn't. I didn't say spear. Yeah, we. Went I didn't that say one out. you stand. Yeah, still yeah, spear. yeah. You never it said I tackle. had to stand stationary. It says tackle. There we go. It says tackle because it says tackle. No horse collars. That's illegal. Yeah. Yeah. That, that doesn't count. And those, and it doesn't count as a tackle. I now remember. that would be the dick move I if he started getting penalties on purpose mm-hmm. and saying, "Well, those aren't tackles," and then they just yeah. let him beat me up. That would not be cool. <laughs> not that would be seriously. unsanctioned. It's my it's my game. Yeah. I'm not gonna let Vontez beat the shit out of you just because <laughs> he might though. That's why he's not. In the league. Oh yeah, he will. Yeah, yeah, he will. Vontez, come do tough choice. You're not doing anything. <laughs> come on. Now, now it you're is really time. trying to get us killed talking yeah. shit to Vontez. <laughs> I didn't say shit, Fontes. <laughs> I'm just saying, come do tough choice with Kazim Rahman. You're not, you're not, you're busy. You're not busy. Well, I mean, yeah, the league's not even well. They're yeah. about to do the Super Bowl. Tom Brady's about to probably win again. Jesus yeah. Christ, this guy. We'll see. Who knows? I'm, this I, won't come out till April. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> All right, it's fine. Next. Now, ladies and gentlemen, it is time for our newer segment. Something's gotta go. Get out Get out of here. here. Get out of here. Get out. I will pose four things. I forgot to tell you about this. That's fine. I will pose four situations, four people, four places, four things. And you tell me, Tim Mathis, what can get the fuck out of here. Okay. All right. Football players. Tom Brady, Peyton Manning, Joe Montana, Aaron Rodgers. One's got to go. One's got to go out of that group. Probably Aaron Rodgers. Really? Yeah, I didn't grow up with Joe Montana. Uh, Joe he, Montana was, was better than he was better than Aaron Rodgers and uh, and uh, Peyton Peyton Manning. Yeah, really? Yeah, he didn't four Joe, and zero four and zero in Super Bowls. Okay, did not lose a Super. Joe's Forty Niners. Right? Yeah, he okay. was the Forty Niners. Yeah, he was really good. He's, mm. Any Joe, scandals? Did I don't do think so. Ben he did it. Scandals? You know what? He did SNL and he did a great job. Okay. You know what? Granted, so did Peyton Manning, but you know who I don't think has? Aaron Rodgers. I don't Aaron think Rodgers has not done SNL. There you go. So Tom get Brady the fuck is out. married to Giselle and he's the GOAT. If and he's in the be, Super Bowl even, again. I don't he even just like took him. Tampa Bay back to the Super Bowl. Yeah. Exactly. So you know what? Tom Brady has to stay. Aaron Rodgers has how many Super Bowl wins? Two or one? Yeah, I think he has two. Two. So okay. does uh, Manning. Peyton. Yeah. Right. So it's it's between Manning and, and Aaron and, and who, Rogers. So, so who's the better comedic actor? Oh, Manning. Peyton Manning. Manning by far. Peyton Manning's Manning. hilarious. Yeah. He plays that. He plays that. Uh, not airhead, but like oblivious jock. So well. very good. So he's well. a very good actor. The uh, it's a, the it's SNL weird. sketch where he's uh, playing uh, all time quarterback with the kids leagues and he's just drilling the kids. Yeah, just <laughs> knocking them <laughs> it's over. Fun. It's, it's fun. great. It's yeah. good fun stuff. It's great. All right, sorry, Aaron. You gotta get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out. Olympic athletes: Usain Bolt, Tiger Woods, Serena Williams, Michael Phelps. This is actually kind of hard. It is hard because I'm not getting rid of Serena Williams. Serena is not going, She's anywhere. Not going anywhere. She is one. Except hands maybe, down, maybe top, to my place, Serena. Top two, top. I can, I can make the point. Top five pure athletes oh, of yeah. all time. Yeah. If you're just looking at like athletes in general. Yeah. yeah. I mean, Serena. She's amazing. Uh, Phelps isn't going anywhere because he smokes really? pot. 
He smokes pot. He's, he's my, just, my he dog. Just, I'm not going to lie. He just swims. I know he just swims. <laughs> if I'm not, and I'm not, this is the thing. I'm not. You know what? I'm, I'm not getting trying to Usain Bolt because I'm what? not. Everybody else is American. Uh, oh. I, I had to choose between Tiger Woods and Usain Bolt. I'm not getting rid of Tiger Woods. We can't get rid of Tiger Woods. I Come think on Tiger now, Woods t- gets way too much hate. Tiger Woods fucks so some hate. hoes. And guess what? Just like Norm MacDonald says, you know how many hoes throw themselves at, at Tiger, Tiger Woods? Wood. This and dude only, is turning. And he only did 14 of them? And he only did 14. That's Come the on, whole. Yeah, guys. Exactly. Come on. He's, Come he's on. turning down 99.9999% of all pussy out there that's Boom. throwing themselves at him. Boom. Meanwhile, if if most dudes cheat on their wives, it's from some bitch that lives in or works at Home Depot. Boom. So, yeah. Right. Don't don't even no. We're gonna get rid of Usain Bolt. And it's nothing against yeah, Usain right. Bolt. He's just Jamaican. Yeah. Now I would the swimming thing. I would have got rid of Phelps. No. But now because that I'm he does about smokes it, pot. Also, he is the greatest Olympian of all time. Yeah, and he did it I all just while smoking that. pot. All that's, while smoking that's pot. That's what's great about it, right? But swimming, right. you got to think swimming is probably a great sport for potheads because you have to think about all the calories you have to eat. The dude's eating five thousand, eight thousand mm-hmm. calories a day, so it's great if you got the munchies. And you're not doing anything but going straight and then turning around. So it's it's great for potheads. Okay. Okay. You served. Now, yeah. you might not want to do this one, but we'll see. Marine Corps, Navy, National Guard, Air Force. I don't know why the Army's not in here, but Army's not in here. Army's not in there. I mean... National Guard is barely a military if service. I, I was going to say that, but I didn't want to disrespect If the Army anybody. was in there, we would have got rid of the Air Force. Oh, of course. Okay. If the Coast Guard was in there, we would have got rid of the Coast Guard. Coast Guard um, counts as like a... Eh, they're Department of Transportation. When I was in, they were. They might have changed them to DOJ. Wait, what? Wait, DOD. the Coast Guard is not part of... The Department of Defense? Not, no. when, I, not when I was in. At least, maybe what? they were. Maybe that was just a rumor we had. What? But as far as I know, they're Department of Transportation. I like how that's a rumor. It could be. <laughs> I don't know. We just made, we were I, in the Navy, so we I, made fun I of the Coast love, Guard people. I love how that's a rumor. It's like Coast Guard's not part They don't. Of us. I mean, they don't. Yeah. You know, they, they okay, just Marine, the coast. I don't think the Marine Corps can go anywhere. Well, no. We need, yeah. them, we need them to snipe some of these terrorists out there, right? We can't get rid of the Navy because I just like the Navy. It's cool. Also, you were in the Navy. I was in the Navy. Right? So it's either National Guard or Air Force. The Air Force doesn't just fly. They do like IT stuff also, to the best of my knowledge. Yeah. But they also, here's my problem with the Air Force is mm-hmm. I think they are, uh, they do a lot of the drone stuff and I'm not a fan. Oh, of the yeah, drone you're stuff. right. Fuck. I'm really not a fan of the drone stuff. Actually, so, you know honestly, what? Honestly, I'll get rid of the Air Force. I would say Air Force also because yeah. the National Guard, like, we're from this. We're like we're from Houston. National Guard's always called to save yeah, people from hurricanes. Yeah, from hurricanes and stuff. Yeah, that's right. National Guard's always called. You've changed my mind. Yeah, and the drone point. thing changed my mind. And the drone thing changed your mind because uh, drone wars are horrible. Horrible wars. Horrible. You, you know, the the whole theory behind it is like, oh, you're gonna stop uh, casualties by just doing surgical stuff, but then you end up killing more civilians. So yeah. Any any strategy that leads to more civilian death in a war is something you should not. No. Thank you. And that is from a man who served this country. Did you hear that? Obama. Also, <laughs> Obama, come do tough choice. <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm just, either one of you, we want Michelle, but we'll take Barack. We'll take Barack. We'll take Barack. I, but we really want Michelle. I, I think you have a better chance with Vontez or OJ. No offense. I can get Obama. I can get an <laughs> Obama to come do this podcast. All right. Last one. The Wire, Breaking Bad. Narcos, Game of Thrones. Don't even talk to me about Game of Thrones. I have only like, seen. Oh, like I Thrones? loved past tense. Loved Game of Thrones. Okay. And what they did to me and every Game of Thrones fan in the last two to three uh, seasons, especially the last season. Okay. I can never recommend that piece of crap to anybody. So you're getting rid I of Game of Thrones. I am getting rid of it, and I want my eight years of wow. life back. Wow. I want it back. I liked it. It. You liked what? I liked it all. You, no. Also, okay. Fair this enough. Is an incorrect fair enough. take. I I watched it. That is after, an incorrect take. I watched it after everyone finished watching it, so I didn't watch it in real time. Okay. I just binged all of you it. You binged all of it. I binged all you of didn't, it. You didn't feel that there was any any drop off from season five to season eight. Honestly, not gonna when, lie. When the major the dragons, when I the like major the antagonist okay. of the of the entire franchise okay. changed three times in three episodes, you didn't find that odd. 
Not really. That's insane. I didn't. Also, I'm not. It was just to me. Game of Thrones was just a show to me. I mean, it wasn't like a. It wasn't like a cultural phenomenon. It was a big deal because I, I was following it. I yeah, was, exactly. I was. I was. I were you into the HBO, books? I, no, I didn't. I didn't read but the books. But you were into the story. Yeah. Yeah, I was just watching it. Yeah. Yeah, I wasn't really. I'm not gonna lie. I'll put it this way: half this the is time, half the time I was watching it, I was like doing work. I wasn't even. I was yeah. just glancing at well, it. Well, if you right? were into oh, it, oh, Daenerys I think is you naked. Would, you All right, now I'm watching. Yeah, then, and they cut that out after like the second because season. she didn't want to be naked. Anymore. Which you know, <laughs> that's very selfish. That's not. Can we talk about hey, that? It's blame selfish. the mother of dragons. That's not. That's not the writer's fault. That would have. Hey, if she would have, if she would have showed a little, uh, a little skin in uh, season I would have given a little bit more. <laughs> Credence. Maybe you should have won that kidding. Emmy. I'm kidding. Okay, so uh, what's leaving though? Oh, Game of Thrones is gone. Game of Thrones? Easy. Not okay. even a question. Breaking Bad and The Wire are uh, I didn't, top two Breaking seasons Bad was of good. all time. Or the, top first two of all, in my time. opinion, The Wire is the best out of all. Narcos is still them. ongoing. They Narcos could, is they could, still going. But here's the thing. Here's the thing. Nothing they could do to Narcos is worse than what they did to Game, to of, Game of Thrones. Thrones. Well, the first two seasons of Narcos with Pablo we're Escobar were great. Damn near... Some of the We're best great. television I've seen. The only on. problem I have with uh, Narcos is I do smoke too much weed and sometimes shows with uh, heavy subtitle usage. Oh, yeah. I get lost. Listen, man. I will. I don't smoke. I'm completely sober and I hate it. So yeah, I, that's just me. And, and I have a lot of friends that watch anime and it's annoying yeah. because they'll be, oh, check this out. And I'm like, I, I can't, just can't do subtitles if it's all subtitles because no, I'll look away for three seconds and now I'm behind. I have no idea who this character Actually, is. Actually, you know what? I changed my mind. Narcos can go. Game of Thrones stays. Ugh. Because it was, because it was still a good show. All right, man. It's still overall still a good show. Uh, Guys, that is the, what were you going to say? I just want to, I want to know what your listeners have to say about I'll Narcos you know. versus Game of Thrones. Email tough choice at Outlook. And whether or not Game of Thrones let us all down. They didn't the come. They let, let us all down. Let it go. <laughs> the way you said that though was just I so I don't like, think you understand how mad I am about yes. it. Yes. Okay, guys, that is the end of Something's Gotta Get Go. Out here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out. <laughs> guys, now it is time for our final choice. It Yay. is a merry fuck kill. Tim Mathis. Yes. Your three choices are Beyonce, Forever and Always. Let's go with We'll do Storm from okay. the X Men. Okay. And we'll do Jean Grey from Jean. the X Men. Jean Grey, not Phoenix. Jean Grey. Kill Jean Grey. Okay. Off, off the jump. Mary Fuck Kill. What are your choices? Kill Jean Grey. You're murdering Jean Grey. Immediately, I'm killing Really? Jean Grey. First of all, she's a telepath. I'm not, I'm not marrying oh, or fucking yeah. a telepath. Damn. Number one. Number two, she uh, usually turns into the Dark Phoenix. Yeah. <clears throat> which. Again, I don't want to be. She does not usually turn into the dark. She Phoenix. does it all the time. She's done it in, in the comics. She's done it in the animated series. She's done it in the movies. She turned into the Phoenix. She only turned into a dark Phoenix like one time for a Listen, couple episodes. Phoenix, dark Phoenix. It's it, all the same. Cosmi if you, I'm not fucking a cosmic entity. Okay. Let me put it that way. Okay. Okay. Stay, stay out, out of my bedroom with a cosmic okay. entity. Fair. So, okay. Kill Jean Grey. She's dead. off the jump. Okay. Uh, Storm or Beyonce. Yes. Which, which one of these black queens are you going to marry? That's a good point. Uh, wait, I'm fucking one, first yes. off. Okay. And I get to marry one. Yeah. Is this, do I have the chance of coming, becoming uh, an X-Man? An X-Man. No. No, I don't. You know this. I know. I'm not thinking that. X-Men are born. I'm thinking, I'm thinking can not I be me. a rap mogul in New York was what I was thinking about. I take okay. over for Jay-Z, basically. You could. Right? You could. You could. I take over for Jay Z by marrying Beyonce. We call it the screw print. Beyonce's not. Beyonce. No, hold just, on. Hold on. Jay Z's not dying. No, He's no, no. I, just, I knock him out of the game, though, because mm. I just took his broad. You did just take his broad. I just took his broad. I'm not going to lie. And if Jay Z lost, Tim Mathis is white. If I took Beyonce, if Beyonce from Jay Z for a white boy, I'm never respecting Jay Z. Especially one again. that looks like me. I'm not the best looking guy on the planet. I'm never respecting Jay Z again. Yeah, exactly. Life. You can't. Yeah. All man, your listen, man. Take your billions and go home. Yeah. Um. So no, I. But here's the thing. Okay. Uh, I would not. Uh, it's a tough question because if I if I this just is not, this should not be hard. This is fake. Who gets married? I don't want to just fuck uh Storm because she is married to the Black Panther, and I do not want to get killed by the Black Panther. Black Panther's dead. Go ahead. But I mean, I'm talking about not in the comics. He ain't dead. R.I.P. Chadwick. Yeah, I didn't want to bring that up because the sadness. But he's but, dead. So. Oh, okay. But there's okay. 
you know what? Mary Storm. Boom. Boom. I, at, at the very least, I get to work for the X Mansion. She gets me a job yes. at the school. You know okay. what I'm saying? I'm yeah. cool with all the mutants for That's when cool. the shit pops off. Yeah. Uh, you get to dab up my Wolverine. kids will be my kids will be mutants you yeah, know most likely most likely they, you know what they'll probably one of them have pubic hairs that uh, cover the nuts that will probably be his that'll mutant probably ability. be it yeah that's fucking okay. worthless in the scale of things so very worthless we marry Storm we fuck Beyonce and then we uh, leak we, we leak the video to Pornhub and, and Jay-Z boom. loses his status boom okay and Jean Grey is dead for you. Jean Grey is gone. Okay. Immediately. This is hard. We all know in the year 2021, the year of our Lord, we said that we would always kill Beyonce and then figure the rest out. Hear me out, Tim. Don't make that face. It's hilarious. So Beyonce, I don't know why that's a rule. But okay. Beyonce dies. Wow. I will, like you said, you, ne- you don't want to marry someone who knows telepathy. No. It's just too much. You don't. Yeah. Because it's not like she... You can never like lie she, to her at never, all. Never. Not even never, about the littlest thing. Never. Ever. Ever. It's weird. Yeah. And she, it's not like she has to touch you. Mm. She just knows how to read your mind. Yeah. You could be... Like, you're on the road. You're a comic. And, and some chick says something to you after a show. And it's innocent, right? Yeah. And then she asks you, oh, did, did, did somebody say something? And you even forget it. But yeah. she knows it happened. She was right there watching. Now you're yeah. in trouble. That's now the whole thing. It's now. a whole thing. So you fuck Jean Grey. Yeah. Right? And you marry Storm. How mad is Wolverine though that you slid in when he been trying to hit forever though? That's fine. He was. How, he, you want Wolverine mad? He at didn't you. murder Scott Summers. I mean, he didn't murder Cyclops. But are you pumping and dumping Jean Grey? Yes. Or, I'll see now. I'm pumping and dumping Jean Grey. So you got Wolverine. Scott I think and would, Wolverine would, mad. Wolverine would respect it. Scott would be. Uh, angry. Scott would be mad. Cyclops would be angry. But you could take Cyclops. He kind of put pussy. Not really. Not really. But I mean, if you had a if he, gun, listen, if you had a gun, if, you if could Cyclops, kill Cyclops. If Cyclops. That's what people don't get about Cyclops. Like, you just oh, kill yeah. Cyclops. Damn. Yeah, you're right. Cyclops I mean, if, is not if like I saw Cyclops armor. walking yeah. 200 yards away okay. and I had a gun, I would just open fire. I might hit him. I might not. I'd have a chance. I if see you, Wolverine. I'm fucked. Bro. I see Jean Grey. She got that. She bro. got telepathy and telekinesis. She could kill you easy. Bro. Storm. At the same time, <laughs> if you miss Cyclops. Oh, you're going to die. It's over. Yeah, you're going to die. I mean, it's, listen. It's listen, over. Real talk, Cyclops would probably kill either one of us. But, yeah. Uh, but if I had a gun from behind, yeah, it's over, Cyclops. It's over. I'm going to kill Cyclops, then fuck Jean Grey, then go home to Storm. She can't know what happened. She don't have telepathy. That's true. Boom. Boom. But she is a black woman, so she'll find out eventually. She'll find out. She'll find out eventually. Yeah. All right. Well, guys, that's our episode. This has been Tough Choice. And, yeah. And with, you cheated on her with a white you girl. Cheated, oh, fuck. You're yeah, that's die. not... You, you a fucked up. A black woman that knows thunder is <laughs> dangerous I, woman. I did the best thing. I killed the white girl off front. I know. <laughs> that sounded terrible saying it like that. I killed her because she's the dark Listen. phoenix, and I don't want her well, reading my mind. Yeah. Okay. Also she's it wasn't. White. Yeah. It also wasn't that. She's white, but, but that's fine. But mainly, it was the telekinesis, uh, tele- telepathy. Guys, that is our episode. This has been Tough Choice with Kazim Rahman. I've been Kazim Rahman. You can find me online at Kazim Comedy. That's K-A-Z-E-E-M. Tim, where can we find you? Uh you can find me. Uh, not. All that many places right now. Instagram, uh, Tim Mathis Comedy. Boom. Twitter, Tim Mathis Comedy. I'm Boom. Got a YouTube, uh, Tim's Toys and Comedy. It's yep. uh, I just started it, so it's not much in there. I got one sketch and that's fine. A couple of toy unboxings. I uh, unbox toy stuff that. And I we will on. add all of that to the episode Maybe. description. And Yay. if you have a tough choice question or a Mary fuck kill you want us to consider, email tough choice at outlook.com. That is tough choice at Outlook.com. I've been Kazim Rahman. This has been Tim Mathis. You guys have been amazing. Bye. Goodbye.